Hi, The Edge. Yo. Uh-oh. Dude, we're done. I'm done. I'm done with you. You drive me. You're driving people nuts. No one liked you yesterday. You're just a dick. Well, you didn't believe that I have imaginary friends, you know? No, I believe you have imaginary friends. <laughs> then, then why were you a prick to me? I wasn't a prick to you. Oh, Adrian. Uh, FYI, no, you I'm were. done. It's already starting off on a bad note. Yeah, huh? I'm done. You're getting too paranoid. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, sorry I was paranoid. I'm done. No one likes you. Look, it will never happen again. I promise. Sean email. Get this dummy off the air. I cannot stand it. Please take this idiot off the air. That's Marie. Hey, Marie. Don't you don't you have a don't you have a husband to get pregnant? Uh, you can't make men pregnant. Whatever, man. This is from Kelly. Please take this guy off the air or shoot me in the face. Oh, see, that's harsh. That last bit with Adrian. Boring. That's from Matt. Seems like the kind of guy who doesn't get punched in the face enough. That's from Andy. <laughs> Sounds like you're saying it to yourself, Mandy. Andy. <laughs> That's what I said. No, you didn't. You said Mandy. No, I said Andy. Andy. No, you didn't. You said See, Mandy. this is part of the problem. Yeah, People can... No, I didn't. You People said don't Mandy. like liars, Andrew. I know who he is. I didn't make no, him No, you up. don't. You don't know who he is. See? It's Andy. Look, Matt, D- Dean, I'm sorry, okay? Please, can you just forgive me and no. let's just put this behind? No, I'm done. I, 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 you're, this, here's another one. I'll, I'll, every minute this F stick is on the air is a minute I can't get back. F word. That's from Craig. Clay says, get rid of Adrian, he's past his prime. Someone from a BBM number says, get this idiot gone. Tell Adrian I'm driving to square one to punch him in the face after being a stupid effing idiot. Bring it on. For the love of all that is holy, thank you for hanging up. This is from yesterday. Yeah, no one wanted to Get this to moron hear off the air. Commercials are more entertaining. Adrian needs an imaginary punch to the face. So sick of that loser. Thanks for giving us a good show, boys. Cheers, Tom. No one likes you. Okay, well... How about this one from Fred? I've been listening to your show since 2005. Every weekday morning, I set up my store. You guys are on the radio. I turned you off for the first time ever while Adrian was on. You need to stop encouraging him. He is not funny and never will be. I still got it. No, you don't. No, dude. You got nothing. It's over. You're just just enabling them. No, I'm not. How's he... I'm just reading their emails. after the fact. This is from Patrick. I would rather peel off my skin and... Man, so does Melanie. I would rather peel off my skin and roll in salt than listen to this clown. That's from Patrick. Yeah, at least Melanie still loves me. No, she doesn't. No one likes you. <laughs> They're just sick of your really? crap. I talk to her all you the go time. Nuts. Yeah, yeah, but she just she's nice. Melanie's nice. She just talks to you because she doesn't want to make you feel bad. She doesn't want to read these emails to you. Guaranteed. If I answered the phone, everybody would say they hate you. And I'm sorry, but you did it to yourself. I gave you lots of opportunities. I was nice to you. Well, so it's over. You. I'll prove to you. I'll prove to you. It's over. Josie. What? I'll prove it to you. Why don't you just say sorry and say, you're right, Dean. I was acting like a dick. I get why people can't stand me right now. Hopefully in time, I can make it up to you guys. And here's the other thing. Here's the other thing, tough guy. I have the ability to ask these people that work here to never talk to you again. Listening to Adrian, this is for Max. Listening to Adrian is as irritating as having a homeless person pee in your open eyes. Oh, my goodness. Hmm? Now, that would be annoying. Because your eyes would be open. And Are probably you done sting. Reading emails? Nope. I'm trying to prove to you that. Because I, I look, look, I said you're wrong. I'm trying to apologize and I want to make it up to you. No, it's, uh, we're done. There's you just no, said no that because I just said that. No, I yeah. want to make it up to you. Tell me, tell me what it is and I'll make it up to you. Don't call anymore. That's what you got to do to make it what? up to me. Yeah. What? What did I do wrong? You freaked out. You said the F word like 800 times. You're not funny anymore. I'm sorry. I said the F word. You were lying. We don't like liars. Look, I'm not lying to you. Look, this is, look, this is, swear, no more F words. I swear, no more. How can you be consistent? How do we know? You've said that in the past and then you've gone, (laughs) gone and done it again. Well, I was depressed, you know. You can't have excuses, Adrian. I swear when I'm depressed. I try to love all my human brothers, but I am trying to enjoy a walk this morning. I want to step in front of a slurry truck listening to him. I can't believe Adrian is a part of anything, not alone your show. Please kill me. Please get rid of Adrian. He's getting old. These are all different emails. What's a slurry truck? Uh, it's like a poop truck. Oh, it is? Yeah. Okay, I didn't know that. Yeah, it's like, uh, I like Adrian. Give him another chance. That's from Jeff. See? One guy. Steven says, I find Adrian funny, so what's wrong with me? Ask him to do chop suey again. I hate Adrian. Thanks, Tom. 
So, unfortunately, I just, I can't have you on anymore. Simple as that. You've kind of burned all your bridges. Seriously, sick of the Adrian bit. Not funny for a long time. That's from John. You just think society's work, that's all. What? No, I'm not. I'm just reading emails from people that listen to you. Look, I promise you, no more F words. I swear. No, I don't know, dude. I I think we're done. I swear on my father's life, I will never. I will promise. Dude, your dad's got cancer. Don't swear in his life. No, I think he just has a slip disc. Oh. (laughs) Come on, Dean. I'm I'm serious. I'm sorry, man. That was one funny part about you, Adrian, yesterday. When you said your dad had to go see a chemotherapist. And it turned out to be a physiotherapist. That was was hilarious. Yeah. Yeah. But that was pretty much it. Yeah. I mean, you have very little to offer us anymore. All you do is get mad and swear and act like a tool. And quite pra- frankly, you, people don't... Dean, no, you're not. a bully. Here we you go again. You are a bully. Okay, I'm done. Thank you. The more the more you talk like that, the more I'm just going to hang up. Because you're not being accountable. No. You can't blame other people, oh, don't Adrian. don't use that word. Like he's going to figure that out. <laughs> accountable. He's going to think he's going to do math. <laughs> Taxes? Okay, so I think we're done. Adrian's voice is like needles in my head. That's from Paul. Ooh. Karen, I literally woke up and first thing I hear is this idiot. Seriously, two days in a row with this douche? Not funny at all. I'm going to shut off my radio. Uh, can't have that. Sorry. Yeah, well, I'm still going to Edge Fest. So bring it on. Now you're making demands. Yeah, now I'm just going to shut you out of there too. Okay? Whatever, man. I'm still going in. Adrian. No, you're not. Yeah, I am. No. Yeah, I am. No. I bought the ticket. My mom bought it for me through the Inside Edge pre-sale. <laughs> Your mom still buys you tickets? Yeah. Did How many coloring books did you have to complete for that? You know, like, now you're just mocking me. Stop no, I'm, I'm asking me. you because that's how you get allowance. How many coloring books did you have to do for that? No, I just get, no, I just get allowance every Saturday. Yeah. How old are you? 26. Mm-hmm. How old are you? 40. Well, you let me know how that goes. It's going great. I give myself allowance. <laughs> I, was being, I was being sarcastic, Dean. Actually, Dean, you give a lot of people allowance. Yeah. Doesn't that suck? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, that's just a <laughs> handout <laughs> for the next right few years. Right. Right. That attitude does not apply. Yeah, I'm done. I'd rather get an HJ from my sister than listen to him again. Oh, that says a lot. I thought I stepped in front of my car yesterday, I so I sped up. School. I was bullied in school, you know. I'd rather poop razor blades than listen to Adrian. Kidding. He's all right. I was bullied. Can I was you dress him in, in a frog school, you know? su- Can you dress him in a frog suit and have him run across the gardener? I don't care if you were bullied. Everybody Play was bullied. Play Frogger? Is that what that yeah. one is? Let's play some Frogger. Live Frogger with Adrian. <laughs> 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 we should do it. We should do, it. We should do Live Frogger <laughs> across the 401. Hello. <laughs> Come on, I'm sure Ross understands. <laughs> oh, come on, please. Just give me another chance. No, I don't think so. I gotta do I gotta do the edge files, okay? I'll talk to you later. I'll talk to you never. I'm done. Okay. I was bullied as nine. <laughs> nine years no. old, I was bullied. Elementary school. No excuse, man. You can get over that stuff. Please, I, I promise you no more F words. Will you will you do what we say? Yes, sir. Will you play Frogger on the four oh one? Yes, sir. Okay, let's have a listen. <laughs> Picture Adrian in a frog suit right now. <laughs> jumping across. Oh, there he goes. Jumping Rip. across. The... Rip. <laughs> rip. Rip. Rip it, rip. not rip. I was croaked. I was croaking like a frog. You're pretty good, Adrian. <laughs> oh. Do, 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 do. Adrian is a waste of breath. He is not funny. Tom. Watch out for that truck. Rip it. Wait. Ribbit. Oh. oh. <laughs> yeah, but if he does it for real life, that 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 one that last you one's a real mess. Yeah, yeah, it's a real mess. <laughs> anyway. Ribbit. I don't know, dude. I think we're just gonna be done with you. Yeah. Okay. This isn't over. Yeah, it is. No, it isn't. Totally. Not till the fat lady sings. Well. And Tila Violet's the fat lady. Next level.
<laughs> All right, that's it. Have a nice life. We're done with you. Okay. I'm still calling Josie. She, no, you're not. She's a good friend. No, she's not. I have good friends better no, you than don't. you. No. Better than you. Look, I look. <laughs> Look, I still, I still keep in touch. Or you just wait. I'll call her, and she, and she, she's gonna show that she still loves me. You, you, you see, you see. Are you hearing this, Josie? Are you hearing this, Ross Winters? Dean Blundell is bullying me, and I'm not having it. You're not getting bullied. Yes, I am. No, no, no I'm just saying that you're, you're not. You're doing it to me, right? I was bullied in grade nine. Hang up on this goof. <laughs> no one likes him anymore. Nobody. Completely worn out as welcome. If you stay on hold for four days, I'll put you on. If you stay on hold from now till Friday, I'll I'll put you back on Friday. No, you won't. Yeah, I will. Stay on hold till Friday. No, you won't. We have to check in every day on this line for four days. Say yes or no or I'm hanging up. I don't believe you. See ya. Seriously can't stand to listen to this turd anymore. I've listened to 10 years and can't remember being so annoyed. That's from Jonathan. Yeah. I I like these little straw polls we do from people. They hate them. Can't stand them. Yeah, I'm done with them too. Folks, that's the last time we'll hear from that dude. I was just minding my own business. It's the Dean Blundell Show. I was like, boom, it was coming up. Boom, boom. Everyone was like, The Dean Blundell Show. Reality hits you hard, bro. 102.1 The Edge. Fuck you, Dean Blundell!